All right, welcome back to Pokemon Soul Silver on Nintendo DS. <laughs> I'm sorry I've made one in such a long time, but the thing is, uh, uh, where I currently am, a recording is very inconvenient for me. Okay, so okay. Anyway, uh, once again, uh, I'm gonna say this uh, for those. I'm gonna say this for the umpteenth time for those of you who are new to subscribing to me. Okay, uh, I'm mostly known for uh, Final Fantasy and Resident Evil, but I am a diehard Pokemon fan as well. Okay, all right. Uh, I'm in the Johto. I mean, um, I'm in the Kanto episodes right now. Okay, I've already did the Johto. Let me just uh, show you my team. All right. Currently, Espeon's at level 45. Naive nature, not bad. This is my favorite Pokemon, Nine Tails, aka Lococo. All right. This is what I use to. Let me change this. Let me see what we, what we got here. Mm, that's not bad. Uh, I use her to mock the flow of the Elite Four. All right. Uh, this is my star Pokemon. I chose uh, Ch Chikorita because. Um, most walkthroughs use uh, um, Cyndaquil, okay? And it's getting very typical, so that's actually the main reason why I chose Chikorita, not Cyndaquil, because everybody uses Cyndaquil, so I wanted to be different, okay? And last but definitely not least, we have Starmie here. Starmie is a great water Pokemon because of its speed, special attack, and awesome move pool, okay? And great ability with um, uh, Natural Cure. Natural Cure is very helpful for the main game. You won't have to continue to use items to hear those annoying status effects and stuff, okay? All right, let's continue with the Kanto episodes. Uh, I've I've already beaten Surge and Sabrina. Okay, uh, I'm gonna do a little surfing and then I'm gonna fly back to um, back to Saffron City. Well, here we go. Okay, now from here I should be able to fly back to where I was on the last episode. Let's see what we got here. I have a Lugia. Uh, no, this is the Pokemon League. I can't go there. Damn. Well, actually, I have to go. I have to go to the Pokemon League first. To yeah. Wait a minute, I didn't have to do that, did I? I could have just... Ah, uh, well. Uh, there's my Lugia. I'm not using it because it's Uber. Speaking of Ubers, uh, I was on... I was on... Smogging the other day. Uh, new, news to me, okay? Apparently, Salamence has been bumped to Uber, which is very unfortunate because, you know, I like Salamence. I didn't use it that much, but I did like it. Uh, let's see. Where was I? Uh, here we go, Saffron C, okay. Uh, Salamis has been bumped to Uber, but apparently if if it gets to turn to Dragon Dance, it's just as dangerous as um, Recrasis, I guess that's why it's bumped to Uber, because uh, Salamis with a 600 attack and over 400 speed doing the uh, Outrage, is just, it just isn't, 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 isn't funny, alright? Okay, back in Saffron City, let's see here, this is where I left off on the last episode, okay. Uh, Pokemon has like a lot of side side adventures, but I'm just gonna focus on the main on the main um, stuff right now. After I beat the final boss, then I'll do some of the side quest stuff, right? Including the uh, the Enigma Stone, okay? Cause uh, oh yeah, I, I need to note that uh, until the end of this month, until the end of August, all right? Very important. You can uh, use your um you you you, you can download the um. The Enigma Stone for to catch a Latias and Latios, okay? So you might want to do that. But they said that if if you do that now, before um, talking to Steve or something like that, you won't be able to um, get one of the Hoenn starters. But uh, I have Emerald, Sapphire, and Ruby, so I can just pour it over if I want to, okay? Uh, if I remember correctly, uh, am I in Serena City already? Damn, that was that was fast. Uh, the home of Misty. <laughs> Why did you guys replace Misty? What's wrong with you? When are you gonna bring her back as a as a protagonist? Actually, I think they said that Misty will never will never uh, be um, brought back as a main character in, in anime series. It's very unfortunate. May's cool, Don's cool, but Misty is just like you know, it's it's not the same without Misty. Okay, I'm talking too much. Uh, I remember that the gym lead isn't here right now. Isn't this the isn't this Mrs. Jim? She shouldn't be here yet. Oh, that's the what 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 is all this? Mm, okay, looks like the gym has been changed completely. It's not a straight walk to her anymore, unfortunately. You got okay. Here we go. She will be up here, but unfortunately she's not here yet. There's supposed to be a guy to she's not here yet. Now, if I remember in the uh, in the old school days, uh, there's a there's like a she's up there by Bill's house. She's flirting with some dude, and then she's gonna call you a pest or something. Okay. So let's go work our way there, shall we? Once again, I'm pretty sure that that there's like a lot of side stuff here that I can do. 
I'm not gonna worry about them right now. I'll if it's something really really important, I'll probably note it later on. I just wanna do the main story so I can you know, get to the final boss and, and and get all this extra stuff. Is this a double battle? No, it's not. Leave you alone, you. Uh, screw you. Okay. Uh, you can catch Mewtwo down there, but uh, I'm pretty sure I can't do that right now, so I'm not going about looking over there. All right. Okay, let's see here. What we got here? Looks like a youngster or a nerd or something. Let's see. Beat the six of us. Oh, this is the six thing. Okay. Just like in the original version, you, you fight these six trainers or something like that. I don't know. What we got here? School kid, Dudley. Dudley. We're ripping off Street Fighter 3. Okay. And Street Fighter 4. Super Street Fighter 4. Okay. Because th they decided to put Dudley in there. Okay. He was nerfed, unfortunately, just like Makoto. Man, man. Makoto's still a badass, but she but she got nerfed the big time in, in, in Super Street Fighter 4, unfortunately, so. Okay, that was pretty easy, alright. Once again, I, I have the Psychic Attack TM, but SPN has side beams, so that I'm, it, and that's all I need for, um, for, for the main game, so I'm not going to waste a good TM on a Pokemon who really doesn't need it. Alright, what we got here, Ellen, let's see, Weekly Tough, okay. Level 40, this thing has a lot, and I mean a lot of hit points, let's see here. It's normal type. Side beam is probably gonna do like half a half because this thing has a lot of hit points. Let's see what we got here. I'm gonna let uh Lococo take a little break because shh. I'm gonna let Lococo take a break here because my other team, my other Pokemon are under level, okay. Lococo is like over 50, so she's actually straight for 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 most of the part. Alright, what we got here? Die, thank you. Granbull. Oh, I hate this this Pokemon. This is another uh, underrated Pokemon right here. Don't the, the only thing I see wrong with Granbull and Compared about the fact that it's slow. If this thing, uh, that's right, you got to say. But if this thing wasn't slow, it wouldn't be a bad Pokemon. Intimidate. Uh, great Attack. Earthquake. You know, Shadows Crunch. You know, e e everything you need for it. Just about this thing has just about everything you need for a. Um, for a physical sweeper, right? All right, let's get uh, Meganium out here. Espeon can't have this thing until that uh, side beam comes back. Meganium, take down. You miss. My Meganium has choice cost. Let me just do a nice quick pedal, da pedal dance here. All right. Pedal dance is a grass version of Outrage, but it's not as strong. Uh, Outrage was just was just beefed up here in this uh, fourth generation. Outrage used to have a base uh, base power of 90 and it was special attack, but now that it has a base power of 120 and it's a physical attack. This led uh, out this led uh, Garchomp and uh, Salamence uh, to be banned, and that, that's very understandable because th those two dudes are just very dangerous. Okay, but at least now we don't necessarily have to worry about have have to have a, a, a ice beam user because you know. Well, I still like ice beam. Hello, how you doing, Crystal? Blah blah. You spent my money, okay. Uh, once again, uh, this time around, it's very, very good if you uh, if you let your mom save money because she she gives you like very useful berries and very good items like 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 torch scarf and stuff like that. So she should get some pretty useful stuff here, okay. All right, let's see. Looks like we have another school kid here, number three. I won't be easy. Well, let's just see about that, shall we? And I forgot to hear Espeon outside of battle. Unfortunately, what we got here? Uh, Tangela, Espeon's at half health. I don't have more sun yet, unfortunately. Psybeam. One hit KO. Die. Next. Level up to 46. What we got here? Let's see. Vaporeon now in the oh no Vaporeon the, why is it you know what I didn't I didn't actually realize until I used a Vaporeon myself what was so good uh, uh, um about it it's it's annoying to go against because of those high hit points if you train it defensively it's it's not bad okay but it took me a while to actually see what was so good about uh Vaporeon why it, it's overused okay uh and. I'm thinking about using it on my team, but um, I'm talking about on my main um, competitive team, but I've already got a water type there, so. But Vaporeon counters a lot of physical sweepers, so.
it counts Gyarados too because of the, because of uh, water absorb, and it can't feel the ice vein, so Gyarados can only hit it with earthquake. Um, Vaporeon can can take earthquake and uh, you know hit it with the hidden power electric or something like that. Speaking of hidden power, apparently. Uh, a, a major oh I, I love this upgrade I love it saves you a lot of time there's a guy here in this game who will tell you um who will tell you exactly uh what your Pokemon's uh hidden power is all right so that's that's very very useful okay for those of us who uh, don't have time to calculate ourselves all right because that, that, that's kind of confusing sometimes okay so all right let me just heal my SP on here because it, uh, he took a beating all right let's see where we're in I don't have any healing items. Damn. Okay, I don't have any healing items, unfortunately. So let's see. Next. All right, what we got here? Kemper, Lloyd. Let's see. Needle King. Okay. Uh, normally I would switch out because my experience hit points are very low, but this thing is a poison type, so let me just go ahead and hit it with a side beam. Uh, I, I should knock it out with one hit. If I'm not, then Espeon's gonna die, unfortunately. And I did. Die. I remember what I was about to say now. Uh, normally, uh, in, in the old school days, uh, Espeon learns a uh, psychic at level 47. Unfortunately, this time around, it doesn't learn until level 64, which is very, very unfortunate. I doubt, uh, I doubt it's gonna get that strong doing this LP, so. Is this a double battle? I'm number five. Yes, it is. So number five is double battle. Okay, that's a little change there. I doubt I'm gonna reach level 64. Not for my uh, my batteries get rid of die rate damage. Okay, I did not charge my DS overnight, unfortunately. So okay, here we have a poison type and a bug type, and I got a psychic type and a fire type. So let's see what we got here. Side beam on gloom and flamethrower on Paris. On Paris, okay. Once again, those of you who are new to subscribe to me, I am a diehard Pokemon fan, so uh, please uh, do, do not be surprised at my um, at my knowledge of Pokemon games, okay? Because I, I I've been playing I've been playing Pokemon since Gold and Silver. I just didn't tell you guys, okay? But I love Pokemon. I love me some Pokemon, okay? It's super effective. Die next. Pidgeotto and uh, what else we got here? Another Paris, another Bug type. Let's see. That Pidgeotto, I can always guarantee that Pidgeotto is gonna use a quick attack. So let me just get my Espeon out of here and replace it with a Starmie because Starmie has Thunderbolt. I mean Thunder. In the meantime, I'm gonna use Espe I mean Flamethrower on the Paris so it doesn't use something like Spore or something like that. Let's see. Come back, Espeon. No quick attack, Pidgeotto. Hmm. Oh well. That was just a precaution. I probably won't be able to win here with anyway. Die. Next. Ah right, damn. In case you haven't figured out by now, uh, I focus on using Pokemon with high speed most of the time. The only exception is a uh, Meganer, but I gave it a twist scarf for a nice fast pedal dance and a nice fast uh, uh, frenzy plant. Okay. Ice Beam on Pidgeotto and Flamethrower on Parasite. Okay, so these are these are a couple of guaranteed one-hit KOs here. Go. Go. Yes. Yeah. I'm a corner. Okay, wait, wait, let's see. What we got here? Uh, Bellossom? No, I don't want to kill Bellossom. This is like, this is one of my favorite grass types. I love Bellossom. I don't know why. I just do. Probably because it's so cute. Okay. All right. Let's see. Flamethrower from the Coco here. Let's see what we got here. Uh, Bellossom's pretty defensive, but it's not going to survive a Flamethrower from level 53, the Coco. Okay. Super Dev, die. I'm sorry, Bellossom. I like you. Okay. Start me. We defeat Laura and less, less Laura and less Shannon. Okay. 
All right, uh, let's see. Let's continue on. Hopefully, I get to Misty doing this episode. Let's see. What? 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 What do we got up here? Let's, let's, I can't go through there. Oh man, come on! I got. Looks like I gotta cut that tree down over there. I, I see that little bush hiding over there. I gotta cut that down. <laughs> but I, but I still have my scythe, unfortunately. Super nerd pet. Okay, he has a Porygon. Okay, it's just not gonna be able to. Oh hell no! Let me get it out of there. Uh, let's see. You know what? That Blastoise is gonna be a problem. Let me let me level up my game. That Blastoise at the end of the game is gonna be a bit. That was actually. That was the. T Are you doing a solar beam? You're doing a solar beam. <laughs> That Blastoise uh, at the end of the main game was actually tougher for me. It was tougher than the Snorlax because the Snorlax can be can be taken out with the um, mischievous. All I gotta do is uh, level up a few levels and use a mean look and pass song. You and you'll uh, take it out of there. But that that level 77 Blastoise gave me a uh, gave me a, a gave me a hard time my first time playing it. This time I'm gonna, I'm gonna make sure I level my grass test up. Charge beam. Using a let attack on a grass to Pokemon, but Charles Bean will probably reach his best attack, and it didn't. Fortunately, don't know how that happened. You were just unlucky there. That, that should have reached his best attack. It's seven percent chance reached best attack. Okay, so in a way, I'm leveling up my grass Pokemon so they'll be ready to face that uh, that Blastoise at the end of the game. I can torch scarf and hit it with a quick um, frenzy plant, put a dent in it. And if that doesn't kill, then I bring a Stormy to finish off with a, with a Thunder. I just hope I don't miss. If I miss, I'm screwed. So, okay. All right. Let's see what we got up here. I don't have my Scyther, do I? No, I'll come back and get that later. It's probably something small. If it's really, really important, I'll note it. But, okay. Apparently, you can skip this guy, but I'm not going to do that. He took on more than I expected, but I promise he's a prize. He gives you a nugget, but now we got to fight him, right? This is a cool train, isn't it? Oh, Ace Trainer. Well, well, Ace Trainers and Cool Trainers appear the same thing. He says out a Rhyhorn. This thing has very terrible, I mean, terrible special defense, so I might one hit KO with this uh, side beam here. I kind of doubt it. But this thing's uh, special defense is absolutely nowhere. But his hit points are pretty damn high. Oh, oh one hit KO. Die. Okay. Next. All right, let's see. That's bad EVs for Espeon, unfortunately. War Turtle, okay. I was just talking about Blastoise. How ironic. Uh, let's get... Uh, you're going to take a hit or two. Let's just go ahead and get uh, McGann in my here. All right, and Hydro Pump. Ouch! That's... Uh, It's not very effective. Let me show you how it's done. Fizzy plant. That's gonna leave a mark. Yep. The only reason why I have this uh, frenzy plant is for that. Uh, is it's for that blastoise at the end of the game because that blastoise is not a joke. Okay. <laughs> that blast. Well, it was a pain in the original version, but now. With all these twist pads and stuff like that in the, in this uh, the third and fourth generation, it's, it's probably ah! that's gonna hurt. It's probably not that tough anymore. Flamethrower, no! <laughs> all right, yeah, uh, you wanna play with fire, huh? Uh, let me show you how it's done. Your fire is useless, ha <laughs> ha. Now what are you gonna do? I'm gonna make sure I knock up with one attack. You little son of a bitch. Okay. Okay, I'm still fasting you. Watch this. SS no, I'm not either. Okay. Every ace, uh, your friend does useless. Highlight them apples. Extra sensory. New people, uh, my nine tails is based on the uh, 200 year old nine tails from the anime, which is why I named it Lil Coco. This is the origin of my favorite Pokemon, mama, right? And that's the very reason why I gave it the psychic abilities, because uh, that Nine Tails anime has like psychic attacks and stuff. It's, it's, that's such a badass Nine Tails there, okay? All right, uh, let's see. You're gonna talk some, aren't you? Yeah, okay. You and your Pokemon are really strong. Of course we are. We we are we are the we are the champions, okay? Uh, Misty should be around here somewhere. She's gonna call us a pest, I believe. Uh, 
That's how it was in the original version. Where's the? Where is she? I don't remember all this. Oh yeah, that's a that's a shortcut back to. That's a shortcut back if if you don't want to you know do all that turning and stuff. So, Misty should have been around here somewhere. I guess she, she's up here. Where the hell is Misty? Misty's supposed to be here somewhere. And I, isn't this way fight sweet cool? I saw that on on Cerebi.net. On Cerebi.net. Okay, what we got in here? This is a uh, Bill's uh, father, I believe. Uh, a, let me see. Uh, so. Uh, I didn't see it. What? What? My grandson told me that you have Pokemon. If you have that Pokemon, you see it. My grandson told me about Pokemon that has a long tongue. Oh, okay. He wants to see a Lickitung. Okay. He wants to see a Lickitung. And uh, I think he gives you an evolution stone if you show him a Pokemon that he asked for or something like that. Okay. All right. Where is Misty? I'm not reading it, guys. I'm playing this as I'm playing this as if I was playing the original version. Misty was supposed to be around here, flirting with some dude, and she, then she causes a pest or something like that. So, Rock 24. So, let's see. Yeah. No wonder I can't get anything done. I'm not supposed to be in Swirling City yet. Uh, I'm so stupid. I can't believe I forgot this. I just. Uh, I, I'm, I'm so humiliated. I just called myself a dial Pokemon fan. I forgot something like that. Okay. Uh, I'm not supposed to be here yet. I'm supposed to be in the, uh, I'm supposed to go to the, to the, um, to the power plant and, and restore the power or something like that. So that's why I can't get anything done because I'm not supposed to be here yet. Okay. Let's do a little backtracking because I'm not supposed to be here. I got to go to, um, to Route 7 or 8, something like that. I don't know, but I'm, I'm supposed to be at the power plant. I'm not supposed to be here. That's why I can't get anything done. Let's go this way, okay? This is where we're supposed to be going. I don't need to be in Spring City just yet, unfortunately. I want to see Misty. I miss you so much, Misty. Okay. Uh, you know what? I'm not gonna battle this. This is already a long episode. Uh, these, I'm gonna try to battle most of these off screen because you know, these bikers have a lot of poison types, and I just one hit KO them with Espeon. So, uh, why didn't I heal at the Pokemon Center? Okay, uh, I think I did some of these a while ago. Yes, super nerds. Okay, nothing here but Matt and Mice, nothing that little Coco can handle. All right. Uh, let's see, this is a gentleman. Gentlemen usually give off a lot of money, so I fought him already. I think I had to come by here earlier. What we got here? It looks like a apricorn. Let's see, gimme, 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 gimme. It's a yellow apricorn. I forgot which one that makes, but I don't use it. Okay, so. Alright, Lavender Town. Uh, one of the most memorable uh, places in the original game, in the original uh, yellow, blue, and the red games, because of that, that, that spooky ghost that turned out to be a Malrat, which we couldn't catch, unfortunately. You know what? I never tried throwing a master ball at, at that thing. Has anyone ever tried throwing a master ball at that um, at that Malrat that you couldn't catch? And I'm telling you, if that thing had, if, if that thing had at least 306 speed, it, it would be a monster with that uh, thick club dummy special attack. So okay. All right, so let's see what we got here. Uh, I'll do some side stuff later. I just want to go. On. I think uh, I don't think I have to do anything here really. I don't think I have to do anything here. Uh, Route 10. Uh, that's not the way I want to go, is it? Where's the damn power plant? I'm supposed to be going to the power plant to uh, restore power or something. Let's see here. Route 12. I know I don't want to go that way, so I think I got to go up, up here to Route 10. Because I'm supposed to be going to the right. I remember that much, and then I got to surf or something. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think this is the way. Oh, no. What? Ah, I don't want to fight you. Okay. Is this the rock tunnel? Yeah, I got to go through here, okay? I remember this. Uh, you, you need flash here, unfortunately, but I do have my SPN does have it. All right. SPN use the flash. All right. Uh, I don't want to do any. I don't want to fight any level five Pokemon here. So let me just uh, throw some repels. All right. I do that when I'm doing my uh, my EV training, but you know so. I'm really, I'm really curious. Okay, let's be honest here. For, uh, for those of you who do the uh, competitive battling, okay, 
Effort value training is very annoying, okay? How many of us use game shots to, like, you know, fight Machamps and stuff like that? And, you know, get 99 castings and stuff like that? How, how many of us actually use uh, game shots for our... See, using a game shot for effort value training isn't cheating. It means it means that you just don't have the patience. Now, if, if, you, if you use a game shot to do, like, nine, all nine, stuff like that, then, yeah, that's pretty cheap. But using it for every value training and one egg, one step hatching and stuff like that, that's understandable, right? And I don't have a rock climb yet, unfortunately. No telling what I'm missing down there, so. All right, uh, do I have rock smash? No sight to hat. Okay, there's probably some geodudes in there anyway, so I don't waste my time with those bastards. Uh, let's see here. Man, I, I hate tunnels. I, 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 don't, I don't like tunnels. I do not like tunnels, and, uh... I don't remember all this in the original version. It, it, it was pretty straightforward in the original version. It's like a big gigantic maze now. It wore off. It's like a big maze now. I don't remember all this stuff in the original version. Okay. All right. Let's see here. Revive. Okay. Nice. Cause I'll take that. I don't have any. I need to buy some more items because I, I have actually no no healing items whatsoever. And it looks like I'm trapped. Mm. I hate mazes like this, man. This, come on. What's up with all this? Can we just like jump over those rocks or something? What do we got here? Oh, nice. Okay, uh, okay. I guess it was worth showing this because those are pretty rare items, all right? But once again, most of us probably use that game starts to get those. Okay. See, Pokemon isn't just about you know brute force. Well, uh, okay. Kind of like what what, what Koga said. It's not just about brute force anymore. Okay. Unless you use uh, all nine stats, then then you then you then you're completely cheap for doing that. But types and you know the right move set and the right abilities, because some people have two abilities, effort value training and stuff like that. Okay, okay, we made out of that mess. I why am I going to Pokemon Center? I have not done a single battle from the last Pokemon Center. Okay, uh, we have to surf down here. Repair war off. Let's put up another one because I don't need to do any wild. I don't, I don't need to waste me of my time. These are weak wild Pokemon here. Okay, so. All right, what's this way? That's think that's the way to um to Brock. Chad, were you awake? Uh, well, I was I awake? Well, I picked up the phone. So okay. All right, let's continue. Let's see. Yes, we want to surf. Okay. Sorry I didn't get too much done in this episode, but uh, I told you I haven't played Pokemon in a long time. This thing's about, what, 20 minutes long, about 20 or 30 minutes long? We're just going to surf here to the power plant, and we're going to stop right here, okay? So, on the next episode, we're going to continue on with the power plant and try to restore the power, right? I'll see you guys later.